Uh, my name is David Troughton. Um, I play Mr. Tom, Mr. Thomas Oakley, to give him his full title. Mr. Tom lives in a village called Little Weirwold. He's about 67, 68. He's a widower, has been for 41 years. Um, terrible, because his uh, son died in childbirth, so did his wife. And he shut all those memories away, has been keeping to himself for 41 years. He obviously goes out and about the village, but basically he's become a hermit um, in denial of grief. He's kept it all inside him. And when the evacuee, William, comes, um, he can't cope, can't cope at first, but manages, and their story is the play. I've always wanted to play him. I've read, when the book came out in the 80s, I read them to my children. And um, I've seen John Thor do it. I haven't seen Oliver do it, but that's no bad thing, because people always say, uh, oh, what's it like? Did you see? Oh, he was ever so good. And then you say, no, well, yeah, well, that's fine, but um, I'm going to have a go. It's my turn. So I will give it my best shot. It's an unusual story in the fact that it's like a children's book, but it appeals to adults as well. It's a children's book with a huge twist in the tale. Uh, you think you're going in one direction, and uh, she very cleverly suddenly shocks you, really shocks you. Um, and um, I think that's good for children. I think children can take that. Um, adults can. Um, and, uh, well, they hopefully they'll be crying in the aisles. They're going to get um, a wonderful story, beautifully told by a very good cast. Um, a story that is uplifting in the end, but um, you have to get there. You have to get to that release moment um, through laughter and tears, basically. So it's got everything. I've never worked with um, a puppet this closely before. It's great because Eliza is brilliant. She, she's on stage doing the puppetry all the time, but it's amazing. You just forget she's there. Um, and you react as if the dog is there. And she is so good. Um, Sammy becomes real. It's absolutely brilliant. And I'm hoping that the audience will forget that she's there too and just watch the dog. Yeah, sometimes Sammy's a bit naughty, but um, we, uh, we get that out of him. Thanks. Well, I've never worked with so many children. I've worked with children, obviously, but um, to have three sets of two children um, makes rehearsals a bit longer because you have to do it three times. Uh, they all have to get a go. Um, but they're going to be brilliant. Um, it's early days yet, but uh, you can, you know, they're warming to the task brilliantly, so they'll be fine. Well, it, I, I don't know yet because I haven't actually, we work so bitterly at the moment with each pair or each child that we haven't got that uh, continuity yet. Uh, we will do when we start running it. Uh, now I think it'll be very enlivening. It will be different every night, which is good. And it'll be different for the audience as well. That's what theatre is. It's not repeating, you know, methodically. It is repeating, but um, it's different every night. Why should you come and see this? Because I'm in it, um, mainly. No, um, because it's a, a good two hours entertainment at Christmas, a heartwarming story. It'll take you on a roller coaster ride of emotion. Um, it's funny, it's sad, it's horrendous at times, but in the end, it's got a lovely, lovely ending. So um, please do come.